Uh, we do have some some funny stuff that I've got to talk about. Got to talk about it. You know what it is. Ah, South Carolina, you crazy, crazy, crazy fans uh, and crazy, I mean, boosters or whatever you want to call them. This is the most college football thing I have ever seen. South Carolina's live rooster mascot is getting a new name. So, of course, the state uh, over in South Carolina decided that they were going to do a poll. And we'll talk about the names here in a minute. But here's the situation. It says, a new alias for the mascot, formerly known as Sir Big Spur, will be announced sometime between now and when the Gamecocks kick off the season, September 3rd against Georgia State, the university confirmed to the state. Why a name change? It boils down to a disagreement between the bird's original owners, Mary Snelling, and Ron Albertelli. Now, uh, oh, and the new owners, Beth and Van Clark, over whether or not the animal's comb on its head should be trimmed. It says, uh, according to a report from the Charleston Post and Courier, the original owners trimmed the rooster's comb, the red fleshy area on its head, to make the bird look more like a fighting gamecock. The Clarks have opted to keep the comb intact, citing the health benefits to the bird. An agreement with the original owners allowing the use of the Sir Big Spur name has expired, and USC is now guiding the process to select a new name. Uh, this is interesting. It says the university's legal team advised against an old name or against using an old name, Big Spur, which was suggested by fans, um, because it, this is not owned by the university, which is hilarious to me. Now the big, the big suit guy, the big mascot that all the kids get to hug and shake hands with, that's Cocky, Cocky the Gamecock. But the live mascot, the rooster that is there at the football games, etc. Here are the names that they <laughs> recommended. And I'm going to vote on the show so that you can actually see it right here. Uh, but the names that they came up with. General, Coop or Cooper, Cock Commander. <laughs> I mean, what are we doing? Uh, Kicking Chicken, Captain Cluck, Brewster, Cluck Norris, Marco Pollo, Mr. Chicken Scratch, and Cockadoodle Dude. Now, obviously, you know which one that I am going to vote for, but I want to see what the... Yeah, yeah, this, this was bound to happen. 78% of the votes are in for Cock Commander. I don't think there's any way that the university actually does this, but my God, if they did, oh, I mean, you want to talk about awesome. Uh, I, I, couldn't even, I couldn't even begin. Number two on this list... Uh, with only 5% of the vote, is Cluck Norris. Number four is Coop. Number three, General. You know, you had people that started maybe voting for the more serious ones, but, man, I mean, what are we talking about here? Uh, just, just bananas. Just bananas. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app, and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE, and the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.